was awesome! Hey everybody and welcome to This Week in Hearthstone and no, you do not have an incredible case of deja vu, you're not seeing things. I posted Friday's weekly recap video last night and about an hour after loading, um, some changes happened on the Team 5 slash Hearthstone side. So instead of waiting for a week or having a video out that just completely lying to you, uh, let me go ahead and make another video with the edits that happened. Um, all about transparency here and listen, if anybody's to blame for this, I think we should just go ahead and remember, let's blame Hat, okay? We should blame Hat for this. I made the video, I did all the video pieces, and I got it all ready, and then it's all incorrect. So let's blame Hat. Unless he does not want me to start blaming or talking about him anymore, and he wants me to keep him out of it, so don't blame Hat. If he's mad about it, uh, he had nothing to do with this, and I don't want the heat, so just remember that. Um, yeah, so the update number one that I saw was uh, when 28.0 came out, um, they said that Twist was going to go on a two-month break, and the internet blew up and started screaming and yelling. They didn't like the idea. So they posted up late last night a little bit of an update, and I will go ahead and break that down for you. Of course, the link will be in the description of these notes, but in the 28.0 patch notes, we announced that Twist would be going on hiatus for the December and January seasons to return for the February season. We've seen your disappointment with that announcement, so we've decided to update our plans. And there was a lot of disappointment. So we're pleased to see that Twist has some very passionate fans and that players are enjoying the current November season, Wonders plus Ungoro, which is right, they absolutely have, it is really fun. Um, instead of disabling Twist for December, we're going to keep the current format going for one more season. Twist will still be taking a break for January season and return with a different format in February. Uh, why have a break at all? We want Twist to be a sandbox-like mode that lets us experiment with these new ideas and makes you think about your collection in new ways. It was always intended to be a seasonal mode that would deactivate from time to time, kind of like a giant tavern brawl. That break gives us time to learn from prior Twist seasons and prepare for upcoming ones, and we hope it will make Twist more exciting when it returns. We understand now that the announced language was not clear enough in conveying how long those breaks could be. Going forward, we'll do a better job of sharing our plans for upcoming breaks. For now, we hope that you continue to enjoy the Return to Angoro format, and we look forward to sharing the February season with you. Um, I like these changes. I do think it would be a very good idea um, to let us know how long these breaks are going to be. I do feel if you're selling packs for these modes, um, it shouldn't be a two month hiatus um th three weeks a month absolutely cool um i would want to invest more if it looked like there was more an investment in the mode and going away for two months to me doesn't seem like uh it makes it very comfortable for me to spend real world money but let me know what you think in the notes uh let's go over the second change that made me look like an absolute liar yesterday yesterday i talked about that it looked like the release cadence for the next expansion which will be early february 2024 um was different than normal. Normally we get the expansion in April. So yesterday I posted this screenshot. It said February 26 would be um, when the Tavern Pass for Showdown in the Badlands would be going away, which means a new one would take its place. So it looked like the set was coming through. Um, and then a couple of hours later, they go ahead and showed us this, that the Tavern Pass for Showdown in the Badlands is going to be away and out of the shop March 11th, which means... Um, we should be getting the new expansion on March 11th. And if you look right here, March 11th, 2024 is the 10 year release date for Hearthstone. So that's pretty cool. It is a change, um, one that I was not, uh, kind of expecting it. Um, it would be silly not to have it on the release date. I'm very excited to see what's going to happen in March 11th. They've got to be cooking up some huge plans. If you saw everything from yesterday's video about what World of Warcraft was doing with Hearthstone, this will be fun. So um, thank Thank you all for letting me go ahead and repeat this. Um, there will not be a take three. I don't think so. I believe everybody on team five is relaxing for the weekend. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to go play some Hearthstone and I hope you will too. See you in the next video.